Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're gonna be talking about how add to our image, uh, you know, border or shadow in uh, one Swift uh, project. Also, you need to know that there is always link to project source code in uh, comments. And yeah, we're gonna start our project. And before that, we will uh, see that you know, in how gonna be output something like this. We will have one, you know, this image. Actually, we have it, you know, with border, gray border, and uh, you know, radius corners, and this one with blue shadow. Okay, so let's uh, start our uh, project. So I uh, just file a new project then we can uh, choose single view app and then name it iOS Swift you are uh, actually UI image customize or no no let let me say uh, custom image yeah and it's not really important uh, you can choose whatever else you like okay so I create this and uh, what I'm gonna do First of all, I need to make my user interface. So, also, uh, you saw that I used two images in there. So, I'll, first of all, I go to Assets and I go to my Finder, drag my image to Assets. and then I'll go to main storyboard and in main storyboard uh, I need to add uh, two UI image So I say UI image or I can say image yes then I put the one image here and uh, I put the other one here you know what what I do uh, I want to make something the you know different so I choose both of this with command and I go to editor and embed in both in one stack view why do I uh, what I do this uh, because uh, let me go here and you know, actually I go to attributes and choose my stack view and I say space uh, will be something like 30 for example yeah, so same space between them. Then uh, also I make my stack view to be same width and height. I just do this uh, because I want to make this to be always in the middle. So first uh, I align it to be center, horizontal, and vertical. But I need to have them, you know, in. Uh, actually tight to don't change when I do that also uh, you know I, I anytime in any video I try to use other solution uh, to give you folks uh, you know different uh, idea about uh, you know making your user face very important to make your in the interface in a way that don't be you know messy when uh, not Lionel Messi uh, don't be messy if uh, anything uh, you know when we rotate or we use it in different uh, devices so IB outlets week 
about weak and uh, strong and uh, lazy uh, we will talk later uh, you know these are keywords of swift and uh, we will talk in uh, another tutorial will come in soon and if you uh, just need to be uh, subscribe to get informed okay so image uh, view image uh, I named this one uh, view image one and uh, from type of UI image view yes you know that UI image view with the uh, UI image is totally different okay so uh, again I just say I be outlet week var view image this time too UI image view okay so I make this too and then in uh, we can code in our uh, view controller so I uh, first of all I make border you know I want to add border to my view image number one so in view image number one that layer dot border but uh, tell what's the border white so border white I say five. Then again, I say view image one dot layer dot border. This time color. Yes. What should be border color? It should be from uh, type of uh, actually uh, from CG color. But I start from uh, UI color. Then I convert it to uh, you know CG uh, so here I, I can say UI color yeah here you go I choose the red for example uh, for red I just say 0 0.8 for uh, green 0 0.8 for blue for example 0 0.4 and alpha I just say you know uh, 0 0.8 it's uh, just for co color of the border and uh, then also I want to make corner a little bit uh, you know radius not uh, really sharp so I just again uh, say view image one dot layer this one this time I will go for corner corner radius equal 20.0 and also when you do this you need to say layer dot mask to bounds be true okay so this is uh, what we did with uh, view image number one but uh, for view image number two Yeah, so for view image number two again layer but this time I'm gonna uh, you know try to make shadow oh yes there is something wrong I'll, I'll tell you in top uh, let me write this line first so yeah layer shadow I start from uh, for example shadow color so for color I say UI color dot blue I use the you know ready colors and 
then I just convert it to CG color because it should be in CG color format by this and I, sh I need to do that for that one uh, as well if I don't then it will be black it's not gonna sitting there so CG color so yes uh, this uh, layer border color need and also shadow color need to be in CG formats in uh, you know another tutorial about the color uh, we will talk about all of this UI color and CG color just be subscribed <laughs> and uh, yes uh, so this time view image number two dot layer and this time for shadow offset for shadow offset we need uh, its format should should be in CG size and uh, here we can use width and right and height so wide will be I say five and high I say five and uh, after that uh, we need to go for view image number two dot uh, shadow opacity layer I forgot layer dot shadow opacity and I say one for this one and the last one for uh, shadow radius uh, uh, view image to dot layer dot shadow radius yes I say for example 20 yeah uh, that's all we did so you see how easy we just uh, choose an image and then we change uh, you know we add border to one of them and for the other one we add the uh, uh, shadow but it's not end of a story because we need to connect it why it's uh, I I think I, by the mistake I changed this I renamed this yes it should be main yeah okay so yeah I'll, now I go here and in my uh, I, I need to connect this so for connection uh, we can uh, use assistant editor and control drag or we can tap on this one actually right click on control click or even you can go here uh, and uh, then uh, we made two outlet view image and one and two so we just drag from here to number one and drag from here to number two the other things uh, that I'm gonna do, you know, I put this image, I you know made the place one image in assets, so I'm gonna use it. So here I come to uh, attributes inspector and I choose that image to be here. And for the number. Yeah, let, 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 uh, you know what I made a mistake first uh, you know here I just need to choose this one also I've missed this part I need to tie it, this uh, UI image uh, with two constraint to be same size it is now and uh, this one as well so when I add image don't be size of that image yes actually it was good uh, you guys saw that you know how we can control size of our image of course uh, we can play with this uh, scale to feed or aspect to feed uh, to make our image to be in uh, you know normal uh, view and uh, yeah we are good so uh, I'm gonna run this then uh, we just uh, you know quickly review our uh, view controller so you see that uh, we made two IB outlet we connect them to our main storyboard and uh, then uh, we call them here and add some attribute to them so layer border 
you know here I add and uh, so and also I made corners the uh, radius uh, by 20 and also for the second one I added shadow yeah, and uh, uh, you know gave you know some specification to the shadow uh, as I uh, in my experience uh, we cannot use shadow with border both together also we cannot use shadow with uh, corner radius as well uh, but you can test out and see you know how it will work this is something that uh, you uh, can try yourself to be more comfortable yes uh, here you are so uh, now we have it out uh, and ready you will see border here shadow here also I just need to say that you know the first one that didn't work because I had to stop and uh, you know rerun it again and uh, it was just because of this uh, M I you know placed the M a small letter M but uh, it should be capital so yeah here we go so this is gonna be our output and uh, that's all for today I hope you like this video and if you like it please give it a thumbs up and also uh, don't forget to subscribe and uh, you can leave your comments uh, you know uh, your question comment below and uh, uh, yes uh, have a good one thank you for watching us and bye bye